y'all let me tell you my friend these people right now they are so exhausted okay they are so exhausted honey look <laughs> what you just got done going through you left them feeling exhausted, okay? They are really just needing to take a breather. They need some water, okay? They need to get their Bibles. They need to go into prayer because when it came to you, honey, they messed up, okay? You left these people feeling extremely exhausted. And now it's to the point where they cannot come back into your life whatsoever okay so like let's get deep off into this word hey 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 what's up everybody it's your girl aisha aka miss november 21 however if you are new to the channel make sure you go ahead and smash that like button make sure you go ahead and subscribe and while you edit hit that bell and turn on your post notifications so that you won't miss out on any videos that i may be posting along the way you guys okay you feel me so, like I was saying, y'all, make sure y'all like, share, comment, subscribe, okay? Let's get this video run, run me up right now because, y'all, let me tell you, they are exhausted. They are, like, super exhausted right now. You left these people in a tremendous way to the point where they're just like, wow, like, I did not ever think that he or she was going to leave. I didn't ever think that they were going to gain enough strength to to just walk away from me, okay? A lot of people in your life that has mistreated you, that have stabbed you in your bag, that have gossiped about you, made fun of you, laughed at you, you know, talked about you when you were at your lowest, when you were at your like most vulnerable moment. Okay, these people are really feeling exhausted right now because all of that work that they put in to get you to feeling all bad and making you feel, you know, sad and hurting your feelings and doing things to, to you know, get you thrown off your path, doing things to get you distracted and to get you to, you know, fall short at times, getting you to engage in things that you shouldn't have been doing, maybe drinking, maybe partying, you know, maybe just you know, uh, having uh, sexual relationships with people that you know you shouldn't be in. You know, these people are exhausted, okay? They, they put in all of that work trying to get you to do all of this stuff only to realize and to wake up to reality of just knowing that they didn't think that you were gonna ever gain the strength to walk away. They didn't think that you were ever gonna leave, okay? They thought they had it all figured out. They thought they had the plan friend friend let me tell you they drew the map okay they drew the map on this relationship they sat out and they just drew it out okay i'm gonna talk to her like this i'm gonna talk to him like this when they come by i'm gonna set this up i'm finna finna do this i'm finna get home girl or homeboy to do this so we can set this up like they trying to come at you every which way right now that they're, they're running out of options they're running out of conclusions they're running out of you know all these secret secret uh tests or secret what well, well, i can't even think of the word right now but they're running out of plans okay they're running out of plans really that's what it is they're running out of plans they're trying to find a plan to get you to you know they're, they're trying to pull you in for bait okay they're literally trying to pull you in for bait right now okay you are the you're up next okay they're they're trying to rear you back in but it's not gonna work okay it's not gonna work they think that you are finna fall for the plot they think that you are finna fall for the scheme but <laughs> no weapons formed against you shall prosper okay okay no weapons formed against you shall prosper in the mighty name of jesus okay you will not take the bait you will not fall for it okay you left these people feeling exhausted because they knew when they had you you filled them up with so much energy you brought peace you brought love you brought joy you brought happiness you brought you know life into these people you made these people feel valued you made them feel wanted you made them feel appreciated you made them feel like they was enough okay you get you you literally i ain't gonna lie friend you literally gassed these people up and it wasn't like 
on purpose or it wasn't like on accident or it wasn't just to make them feel good but you literally gassed them up to the point where like they started to fall head over heels for you because even though they didn't tell you that they were in love with you even though they didn't tell you that you know all these feelings and emotions they had they kept all of that bottled up in the inside because they just didn't know how to tell you they felt like if they tell you how much they're in love with you you may switch up on them so they kept that in the inside they didn't want to bring that to the surface because they're just as scared as you are they're just as scared to just love someone like you because you are precious you are beautiful okay and, and they didn't know how to treat you they didn't know how to treat you when they had you. They didn't know how to cherish you and, and spend the quality time and, and value the relationship that they had with you. They didn't know how to do that, friend. They did not know how to do that. So what did they do? They chose to fumble the bag. They chose to lie. They chose to, you know, do sneaky stuff and text people behind your back, call other people, you know, do things that you know that you're not supposed to do in relationships and with people that you love people that you care about you know people have hurted you practically all your life you have been in relationships that you know you shouldn't have been in because i i'm not gonna lie you guys we've all been there okay and and this is why god is taking people out of our lives in this season that's not meant to go where we're trying to go because he know that the relationship that we were in it was not meant for us this person was not meant for you friend this person is not your person i know a lot of people talk about kingdom spouse this kingdom spouse that this person was not your kingdom spouse okay it was it was it was satan in disguise okay and i'm telling you right now don't fall for every male man that comes your way don't fall for every woman that comes your way in this season you got to be woke you got to be aware you got to pay attention you got to listen and look with your eyes okay you really got to be on point this season okay don't just let anybody come up in your space and just make you feel some type of way and you fall for it you got to stand 10 toes on everything you do and everything you say set boundaries for yourself so that way people can't just walk over you any kind of Way, okay because you are precious and when people try to come across you they're gonna try to treat you every which way if you allow they're gonna try to drag your name through the mud they're gonna show that they are jealous of you they gonna may even tell you that they're jealous of you they're gonna try to do every little thing they can to make you feel bad my friend but i'm here to tell you friend you better keep your head up throughout the process because when things start going left that's how you know god is right there in the midst of it he's trying to reveal and show you all of these things so that way you can wake up and realize okay if all of this stuff is happening i know this is not the place god got uh, wants me to be right now so i need to pull myself up out of this i need to get out of this illusion because i'm telling you it's all an illusion it's all just a plot to get you to get you caught up in that trap and then once you stuck you stuck i'm telling you friend it's all just a plot and scheme to get you caught up in it so that you won't know which way to go so that you can't hear god's voice so you can't hear the directions and things and the warnings and the signs that god is trying to reveal to you throughout the process okay you are you left them feeling exhausted because they didn't think that you were a prayer warrior they didn't think that you were secretly going in your secret place when they wasn't around they didn't think that you were secretly playing praying okay they thought that you were just gonna sit here and just put up with the put up no you putting that shut to the up okay you ain't you not you're not finna deal with none of none of those things that are demonic that are holding you back that is making you feel some type of way you're not finna deal with none of that you finna keep your head up throughout the process and you finna go hard for yourself there is a lot of people who are trying to stop you who who wants the worst for you right now there are a lot of people who don't want to see you prosper that don't want to see you grow but i'm telling you, you leaving all of these people feeling exhausted that has hurt you that has stabbed you in the back whether it's relationships whether it's family whether it's friends it does not matter okay you are leaving them exhausted because they messed up when it came to you okay you brought all your love and all your energy all your joy you brought all of that with you but the moment you left and the moment that you chose to walk away honey child boo boo <laughs> friend friend the moment you left you took everything back and in this season honey child this season is called take back my friend take back and we taking back everything that the enemy stole for us okay because my friend my friend when i tell you
When I tell you that we finna come out stronger than ever, I mean we finna come out stronger than ever. They didn't think that we had it in us, but friend, we got it in us. And they've been trying to hold us back for years. We've been going through this for years, my friend. But I'm here to tell you that you leaving them exhausted. You got them exhausted, friend. And it's up to you to just make sure in this season that you don't dare look back. You keep on going. You keep moving forward, all right? So that is today's message, friend. I just wanted to hop on here and let you know that i love you guys so much so with that being said i'm just gonna cut it short right now boo but i just want to let you know that i am sending love peace prosperity blessings unconditional love mwah, 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 mwah. i'm sending it all your way boo you know why because you deserve it friend all right and don't ever let nobody tell you any different all right see y'all later lights peace